Wow, what, what a, a night. night. So many deserving winners, and Maestro won nothing. Thank God. And I'm gonna say what we're all thinking. The dog from Anatomy of a Fall should have hosted and been nominated and won Best Supporting Actor. But you know what? It's okay. Because Robert Downey Jr. now has one of Hollywood's greatest comeback stories. I'd like to thank my terrible childhood <laughs> and the Academy in that order. Genius billionaire playboy philanthropist. And Oscar winner. Moving on. Barbie may have only one song, but Ryan Gosling won the night. His performance of I'm Just Kim was riveting and a showstopper. Now, as you may know, La La Land is my favorite film ever made, and Emma Stone is my favorite actress. So when Ryan went to Emma Stone and they sung again, it, it, it I mean, it just, it just gave me chills. That that just gave me chills. And I, I didn't think that would top the night for Emma, but then. Emma Stone. Um, my dress is broken. <laughs> I think it happened during I'm Just Ken. I get it. Lily Gladstone had an unworldly performance in Killers of the Flower Moon, and she was set to be the first Native American to win Best Actress, but this was an absolute tight race. Emma Stone truly showed how far her range could go in Poor Thing. She starts off as an adult with the literal mind of a child, and then throughout the film, branches out into a fully-fledged adult woman who has set her own path. It's a performance that's just exhilarating and unlike anything I've seen in quite a while. Honestly, since Emma had already won the Oscar for Actress for La La Land, I was kind of leaning towards Lily, but I mean, come on, it's Emma Stone. So sadly, Killers of the Flower Moon didn't win anything last night, and also, Past Lives didn't, and that was my personal favorite of the 10 Best Picture nominees. I mean, it could be worse. Maestro could have won something. People are obviously upset over this, but my personal big upset was in the Best Animated Film category. If you watched my Top 15 Movies of 2023 list, you saw that Spider-Verse took the crown for my favorite movie. The Boy and the Heron. <laughs> So, I'm a little upset, but honestly, I can't be. See, there's a reason why I didn't review The Boy and the Heron. I went to the movies to see it right after a long day of work, and throughout the movie, I zoned out every now and then, so it's my fault I couldn't really behold the themes and Studio Ghibli magic that this movie conveyed. This was Miyazaki's most personal film and his second one ever, and without a doubt, I'm going to rewatch this film again so I can appreciate it more when I'm off work one day, and maybe even give you guys a review. My favorite Oscar win of the night definitely went to the Godzilla team. Godzilla has finally won its first Oscar in a 70 year long run, so of course the Oscars would ruin that by playing the music during the speech. I mean, that was just sweet of them. Thank you guys. Uh, we did it. Thank you. Thanks so much. The big winner tonight was of course Oppenheimer, but in a shocking turn of events, Maestro won Best Actor, Best Picture, in fact, it won everything. <laughs> Hell no. Killian Murphy deserved the win for Oppenheimer. Almost everyone saw that coming, but what everyone also saw coming, literally everyone, was that Oppenheimer was going to win Best Picture. No one thought it would win in the most anticlimactic way ever though. But only one will take the award for Best picture. I have to go to the envelope for that. And I will. And my eyes see Oppenheimer. Bro really just didn't read the other nominees, so I guess that means Oppenheimer was the only film nominated for Best Picture, and that means Maestro was not nominated at all. I'm so sorry. I need to stop with the Maestro jokes. Let's see. Um a floating envelope appeared on stage and started speaking. That was weird. You know, overall, a pretty good Oscar ceremony. I'm just going to end this video as anticlimactically as Al Pacino because I, I really don't know what else to say. Uh, this is the end of the video. All right.